and not too many people clapped for me. And I was wondering why. My name is Godot, they call me the company Berlusconi, CEO Berlusconi Records, the only Susu Bishop worldwide, the Africa Black Cappuccino, the Oromata One of Udu Kingdom, Udu Nanganenge One of Udu Kingdom, the Bishop of the Susu Ministry. Don't bother to know me, I know myself. That's how I am. Ladies and gentlemen, little things we do in life can resonate in different ways that you cannot understand. For those of you, who may not know, it was Abiola that betrayed the whole world in the days of greatness. And the whole world pointed, pointed a finger and said, in the day of your own greatness, you will come down. And it happened. Some of you were alive when Sarah, Sarah King betrayed his own father to gain power. And his father pointed a finger and said, in your own day, you will be betrayed. Sarah King shocked. During the last election, even if village people avoided him, that's, that's how powerful it can be. Some of you were alive when Senator Abo slapped a girl in a shop with such an anointing only God could understand. When Abo was slapping that girl, he came for a man who didn't know the slap was waiting for him in Germany. Hello? That was the first time somebody was injured abroad, he came to Nigeria for treatment. That's the name. <laughs> and so little things we do in life can become so powerful. For that of you go to church, the devil betrayed Jesus. And when he was killing Jesus, he didn't know that the killing of Jesus will give birth to different Jesuses. I'm sure you did not know that Mugabe sacked his VP before, drove him out of his own country. Little did Mugabe know that this same man that he drove will one day became, become his president and Mugabe will die. He didn't know that. Some of you did not know that Fajola sacked Abode, a vice president, before. When he was sacking them, he didn't know that the Saki will become the Saka. <laughs> Hello? And when Boha was being sacked, I mean, he didn't know that Boha will come back to become our president. I was in Ghana, and people were complaining. Our president talked too much. I said, You people are lucky. The one we have in London talking in London here. If you provoke and remember the person, two years never come back. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, last year, Dubai proposed that they are willing to put helium balloon in the sky and transport you from point A to point B anywhere in Dubai in one minute. Last year, China proposed they will put artificial moon in the sky and render every street light obsolete. Last year, Rwanda made $400 million from gorilla tourism. That was money made from people who came to watch gorilla. In this country, we don't have gorillas, but we have people who look like them here. <laughs> to make mention, but few, Donald Duke is one of them. RMD is one of them. Right? Oh, you are expecting me to show you like, that? No? <laughs> that is not a gorilla, it's a dinosaur. Hello? <laughs> Just in case. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. I'm very happy to be in front of white brothers who are also laughing to my joke. This is how they worry more. This is the first time they worry more. And when you want people, and in the same hall, and everywhere is peaceful. This is miraculous. I have never seen that kind of miracle all my life. Ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you, on the 25th of August last year, something happened to me. God delivered me from plane crash. For those of you that travel by plane, listen. There's a difference between six and half a dozen. As soon as that plane takes off, the rest is the whom it may concern. Don't be space. Nobody talk about immorality in plane. It's also why I see one baby, no more land fights, bro. We were on that plane, ladies and gentlemen. I was on that plane, techno was there, daily moment was there, flavor was there, we were on our way to that. Nine minutes into the flight. The pilot made a contrary The pilot said, we have agreed. And then he stopped. <laughs> we are answer, don't do what? <laughs> he said, we are going back. Why? He said, because 
was the fault on the plane. When we left fault on the plane, exactly, the earth was without form and form. And that place upon the face of the day, everybody behind the sun caught the holy communion. Hello? <laughs> you have no idea where you are. About 45,000 feet above sea level. You have no idea. So how did that? Okay, have you been in that place? Some of these senators who read newspapers, I know that to come up here. If you sit shaking, you know in play there is business class and there is any hard class. <laughs> and why, why I decided to be flying? I said, this is you from the same play that you all flew. Hello? And the guy who first you and closed the curtain, telling you that, let go now also know. Two things came to my mind. Number one, my sins. At that point, you should think about your sins. My sins are not much, they are only two. <laughs> Alcohol and a head. You understand that? <laughs> and a head means prayer. Something you do when you're a head. A head is prayer. <laughs> so that's my sin. In the midst of that fear, somebody started consoling me. And he said, You know, if you're a frequent fly, things like this should not be strange to you. But how you move from advice to cry is still a miracle for me today. You have no idea when somebody is consoling you in that mood. And he was like, if you know, if you're a friend, I don't say if you are a friend, but fire. It's still when these people don't do no good. No. And I don't tell my wife, I guess, you know, this is what I'm There's a problem here. I move from advice to crap. It's going to be And I was hoping that flavor that was very masculine, macho, will be strong man. Flavor like chicken. You know. All these polypotes that are strong guys. You know. I see flavor. Oh yeah, you might say my brother stop that nonsense. 